In this video, we'll look at whether HCN is an electrolyte or a non-electrolyte. So for an electrolyte, that's a substance, it dissolves in water, and it produces ions. And these ions, they allow the solution to conduct electricity. So that's the definition of electrolytes. For HCN, we should recognize this H up front. That means this is likely going to be an acid. So the question is, is it a weak or strong acid? If it's a strong acid, it's a strong electrolyte. Weak acids are weak electrolytes. We can look on this table of the common strong acids to get an idea. As we look at the strong acids here, we don't see HCN on our list. So we can assume that it's going to be a weak acid. Since it's a weak acid, it's going to be a weak electrolyte. So we have this weak electrolyte. This is a weak acid. And so since this HCN is a weak electrolyte, it's a weak acid, some of these hydrogen ions, they'll come off as H plus in the water. Here we'll get CN minus the cyanide ion, but not very much, only a very small amount. So because of that, we call it a weak electrolyte. We do have ions, but it doesn't conduct electricity very much, just a very little bit. So in answer to our question, HCN, weak electrolyte. This is Dr. B. And thanks for watching.